Well, good morning, everybody. I'm supposed to be a blessing. This is a reading for my Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. If you're new to my channel, I welcome you here. Please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. Hit that bell notification so you'll know when I upload videos. And if you're interested in your own personal reading, call me at 347-227-5723. Let's get into your reading for today. The energies that's coming out for you guys. It's telling me that you... Definitely have a huge decision that you need to make. You're going to have to make a head of a hard decision in regard to someone or something. I feel as though you've been manifesting a lot of good things to come into your life. So just keep up the good work. Your angels, guides, your ancestors, and the are there for you. They're willing to help you. So please make sure that you're definitely communicating with them as well. You could be dealing with an earth sign individual, somebody who's very financially savvy, could be a Virgo, Capricorn or Taurus individual, could be dealing with a Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces individual too. I also see whatever seeds that you plant is going to be very much bringing prosperity for you. You're going to be able to see that prosperity coming in. Yep, new doors and with opportunity open up, there could be some new love on the horizon, you could be dealing with the Aries individual. I see that you're hitting some things head on. Um, it is what it is. I feel like you're guarded in a sense. And it's a good thing to guard your mind, your heart, your spirit, everything in these days. Put on your full armor because they got a lot of people who be trying to come up against you and who may try you. I feel like you've been defending yourself against a lot of people. That's why you're very guarded at this time. You've been defending yourself against a lot of people. But you know what? You've been standing your ground. There's clarity and truth that's definitely going to come to you here with the Ace of Swords. You've definitely been telling somebody out, telling where the fuck to go, where to, where they can get off at. Yes, it is what it is. You could be dealing with the air sign, like I said, but this is you telling somebody off. That's one thing about a fire sign. Fire signs are very passionate. They don't have a problem telling you where to go and where the fuck to get off at. Okay, so somebody's going to feel left on the cold in regard to you telling them off. Okay, they got to deal with that. It is what it is. Temperance. You could be dealing with a set of chairs. I see things balancing off of you here. But you do have a lot of things on your mind. Thinking a whole lot. Somebody could have stabbed you in the back. Or somebody trying to stab you in the back. So always be aware of your surroundings. And also be aware who you allow into your circle. I do see happiness coming in. That's the Leo card out there every day. You have happiness coming in with a fire sign that could be coming toward you. Another Leo said to Aries. But there's also somebody else who is a fire sign and have those energies that are definitely paying close attention to you. Mm -hmm. They ain't blanking an eye. They passionate about you too. Look at the red they got on. And look how they looking at you. They watching you. Even if they watching you from afar, somebody's paying attention to you, okay? um, Definitely a decision that needs to be made here, you guys. Mm-hmm. I feel like you're at a crossroads in your life. So this is the head of a hard decision card here. And this one here, the two of wands, that's the crossroads card. The hell, fuck, they look all the fuck the same. You know, we got to figure this out sometimes. Hey, it is what it is. <laughs> you plant some seeds, you're definitely going to have to let them grow. Um, Some of you could be thinking about a missed opportunity that you missed out on. But I like to be optimistic about things because I figure that the universe doesn't want you to have that. But you're going to have plenty more opportunities coming in. So stop sitting there thinking about that one thing. You know, you got a lot of other stuff going on in your life. The strength card is a Leo card. Stand in your strength. Trust and believe in your sapphire signs because you're birthing out some new exciting things. Mm -hmm. I do see security, love, opportunities coming in. The cherry card just tells me that you're moving moving forward with some things and that's a great thing all right now financial increase on the horizon and the universe is ready to bless you are y'all ready to receive it yes you are i know i am shit new year coming in new year new blessings hello oh shit somebody's definitely obsessing over y'all fire signs leo said this in area somebody's been obsessing over you or you could be overindulging in something are you obsessing about somebody I highly doubt that, but shit, it is what it is. And if you're overindulging in some, get that shit intact. Let's see, you have other cards that came out of where you have the star card. So this is a wish fulfillment card, and it's telling you that things are gonna balance out. This is the Aquarius card as well as the Wheel of Fortune, where you'll be sucking out of one thing going to another. Hmm. Celebrations is definitely on the rising with the Three of Cups, so you're gonna have something to celebrate here. 
All right, now it's a very creative time for you. This is saying, look at that. You see that roof? So, them tell me that y'all get up early in the morning. You're very creative. Look at the red. The red talks about passion. You're passionate about the things that you create, and some of y'all get up extremely early to do what you're supposed to do, and that's the best thing to do. The early bird gets the what? The worm. Shit. Yeah, y'all done heard that before. And I see here definitely that you get up early so you can work and create the things that you want to bring in this. Look at that. Look at all that prosperity. Look at that wealth of abundance. I see there's going to be some new beginnings here. Somebody's going to take a chance on something, and it's going to work out in your favor. Mm-hmm. Just do it. Just carefree. Just do it. Just say, fuck it. I'm out. Try it. Do it. I mean, nothing beats a blank but a fit. You know what I'm saying? You got to try. If you don't try, you never know, right? You have the wish fulfillment card as your last and final card for today, you guys. So anything you're hoping to wish for can definitely come to fruition. All right? Fire signs. All right, my Leo Santa's in there. So I hope you enjoyed this reading. Remember, if you need your own reading, call me at 347-227-5723. Until next time, y'all have a truly blessed day. Thank you.